this footage is being shown on television for the first time. Tower in the middle of the steppe, one of the newest missile systems in modern Russia. Avangard new generation hypersonic weapons, who in recent years talked a lot around the world. Today we will show this complex so close, as far as this is allowed, but still he will be the second hero of our film. Sarmat still remains first. Technology about the most powerful weapon ever created by mankind. If in the first episode we talked about that, how was the first big full-fledged descent from the armature on the air military acceptance? We are now at the famous Plesetsk Cosmodrome. In the second, we plunged into rocket production technology and figured out its device. First impressions when you see this rocket with your own eyes. How big she is? What's in this third? It's time to understand. What is the place of Sarmat in the structure of the RPS? Who will control the new missile system? Where will these missiles be located? How to use? How to protect yourself? And finally, what does the hypersonic vanguard have to do with it? The answers to these questions are in the military reception right now. In order to see with your own eyes promising samples of missile weapons, you need to look into the mine. To see the mine, you need enter the territory of the missile regiment, strategic missile forces. And for this, you need to go the most complex control system, checkpoint, verification of documents, then one more check. This is the peculiarity of our BSM. Intercontinental ballistic missiles are guarded very carefully. Control strip, seismic sensors, surveillance camera. We saw something similar in specially protected sections of the state border. But here everything is much more serious. Therefore, even on the territory of the regiment, armored caps are placed inside the protected perimeter. Fortified machine guns, dots, and much more. And although our film is dedicated to new images, Hypersonic weapons. Now you will see a new product. What is our program for seven? I haven't seen it in existence for more than a year. Never from anyone. What it is? This is one of the many elements of the security system. Missile complex. It's called a firing rig. There are several such installations located on the territory of the combat starting position. This installation is armed with Machine guns that you can see like this. Oh! Machine gun, machine gun, these are not grenade launchers. Yes, it's a machine gun. They are constantly charged. Anytime. At the moment, they are also charged. Eight installations of ten barrels. The operating principle is clear. This car can release a real barrage of steel fire. And not only from machine guns. Grenade launcher unit which is a loaded Avag 25 grenade launcher. This is a standard shot. Yes, this is a standard shot. Who controls this system and how? This system. Operator controls. The system has it. Observation system. That is, there is a video camera here. Archie, yes. At the moment, he sees us this operator. Also here is infrared detection equipment. That work in infrared. Range and allow. Detect strangers in conditions. Limited visibility. At night time. Always charged. Ready to fire at any time of the day or night. This unit is protected from rain and snow. Blizzard winds. This is its value. Here is the operator now. At the request of the commander, this entire system is before your eyes. Closest. That is, here is the direct connection. With who is where. Located in the cow shed. Positive is where we have a day off. This is what the setup looks like. Through the eyes of duty shift officers, a dozen monitors, each displays images from surveillance cameras, including those located deep underground. 
Well, who's to say this is not a real fort? We walked around this guardhouse from all sides. No doors, no entrances. Yes, this is a modern citadel. Only equipment for all. Modern technologies of the 21st century. All crossings are only underground. All crossings are only underground. Covert movement. No one sees anything. Does not know of such guardhouses on the territory of the unit. This is how one of the most important principles of Urbisem is observed. Total duplication. So, the perimeter security system is better than at any border. You've already seen. Remote controlled weapons. We showed you. What about air attack? As they say in such cases, everything is thought out here too. For the little things in front of you is one of the elements of such protection. Equipment for setting up aerosol fields, needed as an emergency. It is clear that this entire area is covered with a dense air defense cap. And here she is finally, the climax of our excursion. This, this is a silo launcher for the Yars missile system. A question I can't help but ask. You have a lot of such installations. There is one launch stop at this site. And the rest are maximum, arsenal point by position area. This is the principle, this is the principle. Separate launch missile regiments. And if we are talking about Sarmatian Avangar, they will also distribute it according to the principle of a separate start. identical. Military acceptance is not the first time on this site. A few years ago, we filmed the loading process into the launch silo here. Yar's ballistic missile. The process is incredibly spectacular and exciting. When you're down here, it seems that a truck is flying next to you. But seriously, this is a very difficult job. It is important that the container fits into the mine absolutely in alignment and in juiciness down to millimeters. And if you take into account the weight and dimensions of the product, you understand how difficult is the task facing rocket scientists. What you see is not the rocket itself and the transport launch container. A special piece of engineering art. They carry a rocket in it. In it she is immersed in a mine. It starts from there. And although the height of Yars is 20 to 230 meters, weight 45T this rocket belongs to the class. Light ballistic intercontinental. Heavy rockets are another matter. By the way, absent in the USA. How classy Sarmat is in front of you. Weight over 200 T. Height 14 story building. However, footage of loading the rocket of this new complex. We have already shown. But what haven't you seen yet? It is a transportation process. And downloads of other iconic new items. Avangard complex missiles. The height of the building here is already about 8 floors. Mask in the Staten area. Under the article and mine. The process of opening a protective device, the step at the starting stop is always impressive. Right now the air is under pressure of 400 atmospheres, pumped in Nemo's cylinder, and they raise the protective device. The climb will take literally, in a matter of seconds. By the way, if necessary, lifting of the protective device can occur virtually, instantly. The mass of this protective device is tens of tons. Now that the weight is taken, again we follow the avant-garde. At first, transport launch container with missile and inside loaded onto loading platform. And then this whole structure repeats. A trick we already know. Dumped by a truck. Despite the dimensions of the rocket itself, here the accuracy is beyond small jewel. A few centimeters, or rather a two centimeters hit in the center of the missile shaft itself. That is two centimeters gap. For such a colossus, for such a colossus, that's right. It would seem impossible with such dimensions. But the practice has been worked out to such an extent that this does not create any special difficulties. The rocket descends so slowly that the movement itself is very difficult to notice. Meters go down by millimeters. You have to make stops along the way. And so on for six hours. This is a complex and responsible which required an excellent composition, maximum ownership and precision. And more than 100 people were involved in the work, as well as 50 units of equipment. Upon completion of the Haribai, a number of operations are necessary to prepare for her combat duty. Everything that happens is meaningfully similar to that. How a shooter loads a cartridge, with one difference the shooter knows, that you won't have to wait long for a shot. 
And in the case of a rocket, the shot could happen tomorrow. And after 10, 20, 30 years most likely never. But despite this, device performance must be provided at any time. That's why the principle of total duplication is so important for Vosen. And second, in contrast to the cartridge, there can be no misfire here. All processes are described in the instructions. The operator stands and reads out the instructions. Operation 1-3, tighten the bolt. He screws it on, performs Operation 1, 3 tightens the bolt and reports. Operation 1-3 completed, the bolt is screwed on like that. Well, the first stage of rocket loading. Launcher step completed. A few days, various technological operations will take place, after which it will be possible to say sovereignty. That it's another. Interface political rocket complex of hunger. Went on combat duty. This footage was filmed in October 21st, previously aired on military reception. For the first time, the general public was shown the appearance of this, promising hypersonic missile system. And now our camera records. Vanguard has already begun service in the troops. Now there is one regiment at full strength. The second regiment is preparing to go on combat duty. And this is the reality of today. By the way, in terms of the impact of missile defense on, this weapon is here. There's nothing even to say from the point of view of countering it. They can't even imagine how it feels. Can we resist today? They are those who are overseas. We will build new missiles as deterrents. The question remains, why does the country need to new missile systems? If there is a heavy Sarmatian, why do you need a lighter vanguard? Let's figure it out. So we guess, what about Sarmat after two episodes of our trilogy? The viewer of a military reception knows almost everything. So let's move on to the avant-garde. First and most important, vanguard is a rocket flying at speed, faster than the speed of sound. And many times, to compare the speed of hypersonic sea serpents, to which, by the way, the military acceptance dedicated big releases, and the launch of which we watched while, in close proximity, on board the frig Admiral of the Fleet of the Soviet Union POTS. So the speed of these sea sorkins is about Mach 9, slightly more than 10 aviation daggers. Sarmat's indicator is as much as 15. It's true that the rocket picks up speed in orbit, where the atmosphere no longer slows her down. But Vanguard is even faster. Almost three dozen swings. Not one weapon on our planet, unable to hit the object, rushing at such speed. Avant-garde began earlier in development, like a missile system. And at the heart of its development, it was the creation. Combat equipment in the form, gliding wing block, which was created. Sarmat is a carrier with huge energy potential, which will bear including, and this is a hypersonic weapon. So we also have one, and more, and this allows us to talk about that we are protected exactly to that extent, which we need for our state. In other words, Sarmat is a heavy rocket, capable of delivering the maximum possible number of warheads over a great distance, with great speed. Moreover, thanks to the large fuel reserve, this missile can bypass the barriers of the spatial system. It is not necessary for the avant-garde to take a deep. He just shoots through this fence like a bullet. So those were the differences. And the common thing between the two complexes is that both of them start from the mine. We are returning to the missile unit in Kozelsk again, where they agreed specifically for military acceptance. Take a tour. Let me remind you that we have already seen how the security systems are arranged the loading of missiles into silos, but the mines themselves turn out to be noticeably different. And Sarmat and Avangard silo-based missiles. Now we are in one of these empty installation mines. There are very strict secrecy rules here. Move the camera lens down there. Where is the rocket? We have no right. So let's watch how it opens. Protective device. Step on launcher. TV people have never been allowed inside an active mine before. 
So in front of you, one more exclusive military acceptance. Only when you are in close proximity do you understand. How big is she anyway? I want to say no cover. This is a very complex mechanism, protective device, whose task, as the name suggests, ensure protection of the mind from any external influence. This is a safety device, covers the rocket not only from snow, and rain is the main task, withstand a nuclear strike and not lose functionality. However, in addition to such protective devices, our missiles have one more degree of protection. This is the distance between the mines. It's clear your VS connection is securely covered and anti-aircraft, and against missile defense. Plus when we have a lot more, what we can't talk about, but even if we hypothetically imagine that some kind of rocket will still reach the position area, then she simply won't be able to block all the missiles at once. Two half time and countermeasures, precision weapons, cruise missiles, which have a specific arrival time, and the task for missile Vistro Dicknego value, performing in response to a counter strike. That's why they are located in the depths. Usually countries have minimal preparation and startup time which, in any case, give them the opportunity. Push missiles. In response, therefore, this is precisely the task. By distribution, separation, mind piece of installation and impossibility at the same time. Besides here, in any situation strategic missilemen must have time to answer. But to launch, it's not enough to just press the proverbial red button, must be carried out accurately. Dozens of operations prescribed by instructions. To find out about, how is the training of FSS officers carried out? We are going to the main specialized university in the country, Academy of Strategic Missile Forces, named after Peter the Great. Comrade off in the last lesson, we looked at features of the operation of the avant-garde missile system. In today's lesson, we'll look at procedure for organizing combat duty on the Sarmat Missile Complex. In this room, students of the Strategic Missile Forces Academy from different regions of the country of Kutsk region. These are future regiment commanders and many of them will be on combat duty, namely on the Sarmat Missile Complex. Note, to the name of the hall, Center for Game Forms of Learning. And don't let the word gaming confuse you. For the armed forces, this is a traditional form of training. Similar games, they are porridge teams. We observed staff games at the country's main military university, at the General Staff Academy. In the event of a sent failure, the meaning of such activities is so that students during the learning process played out various scenarios in regiments and divisions. Personnel air raid alert, air alert. Go to shelter to sharpen the equipment once. Well, what about the young cadets? Their clearance level is predictably lower. And the first knowledge game. These guys are touching on the design of rockets. Let's look at the design of the product. This is the first stage. Provides. Thrust more than 400 tons. Structure of steps, principles of engine operation, purpose of each detail. They talk about all this at the Strategic Missile Forces Not only by example, political missiles in service, but also promising, specifically these parts of the body from the launch missile, nearby hidden from our camera by a black cloth. Worth Sarmat cadets have access to it. In the second episode of our trilogy, we already told, as for the birth of Sarma, it was the Voivode who was the biggest, and simultaneously with the most powerful ballistic missile, countries and not only countries of the world. We said that kill and missiles are made in one size, that the Sarmatians will be loaded into the mines from the governor, but still the governor is a complex of the previous generation. Sarmat is not just strong, but very different from its predecessor. If we compare the previous generation with modern generation, then first of all you should pay attention to the fact that minus one in recent years, significant progress in the development of management system and of course the control system, which are placed on modern rockets, differ significantly, that is, the speed of computers, modern from computers, 
which were in the 70s and 80s. Of course, they differ in many ways. Understand the structure of rockets many times, important for an RBS officer. But it's even more important to learn how to properly maintain them. Simple example loading. Here everything should happen exactly according to the instructions. To master them, the cadets receive the first skills. In virtual reality mode, on the air military reception, in front of you again, the Sarmat missile. Truth in the form of electronic 3D mod with which cadets of the RVS Academy work. What is the essence of today's lesson? The essence of today's lesson is that the cadets are with the help of virtual reality technology. They will be able to work off for performing complex technological operations. Ah, triple control. We have already said more than once about this total duplication. Put it on even more seriously. Triple control. That is, whatever one person doesn't do, controls one more in parallel. There is one more nearby. Each action is controlled by three people at once. One person performs second E, controls how third is performed. Lesson leader. It is relevant documentation. It does compliance under the documentation. And when in life a real rocket is being loaded, everything is exactly so definitely fast and important. Guaranteed correct response to possible. Threats are in the rocket men's blood. Things like this take years to develop. So you understand what we're talking about. We return to Kazelsk again and go to the command post. One of those where the start command can be executed. Like a pyramid loaded into a mine, this command item must withstand any impact, which means it is deep from the surface of the earth. So we descend into the underworld with long, very long, such long transitions that the end of the corridor is simply lost somewhere in the distance. And one more feature, despite that all divisions of the strategic missile forces are located in the depths of the country, in fact, they are always on the front line. And therefore, even in peacetime, there is combat duty here, and only combat. I can say for myself, this amount underground passages and sluice doors, like in RBS. We haven't seen it anywhere. Look at the thickness of these doors. They can withstand a nuclear strike. And this is not an exaggeration. Military accepted. I once filmed a test of similar gateways. In the Leningrad region, the door is secured by an area of a hole punched in the rock. Nearby there is a bag of explosives with the power several tens of kilograms of TNT. In the microwave, such a charge is capable of demolishing multi-story buildings. And then comes the first explosion. Next second third. Visible to the naked eye, the volume of explosives is constantly growing. Testers even reach the figure of 200 kilograms. And the door is standing. Takes a hit. Now imagine that there are not one such gateways underground, not two but tens. Such a barrier cannot be broken. Well, we finally reach the Holy of Holies. Regimental command post. He is behind this door. Please note this is already a hydraulic drive. Open. I ask you to move away from that sector of doors. We go beyond the yellow line like in football. And should disappoint the viewer a little. Now there will be several of these. Lock chambers which the operator has no right to enter. So let's disappear into this space. Let's go in. Into the elevator. Outwardly it is. An ordinary elevator is only very compact, as much as possible. Calculated. On. Three people, we are traveling together. To what depth? About 30 meters. 30 meters is about a 10-story building. About steel strong walls. No automatic doors. Everything is done by hand. People suffering from claustrophobia. Such a lift is contraindicated. Here we need to explain. Why all this complexity? We are now inside the elevator. Lift in container. Container in the mine. What is it for? In case if, God forbid, something bad will happen on the surface of the rain, snow hurricane, or the worst. I think you understand. What are we talking about? The most important, to be with people, those here. Nothing happened. Absolutely true.
arrived at destination. And now, we finally reached the bottom level. Attention question, dear TV viewers. How do you think? What are the remotes again? Gateways and security systems. Nothing like this. That's interesting. What? We arrived straight into the residential area, that is, if you were in some apartment. You first find yourself in the hallway, here right away. Both bedroom and kitchen. And well, like on a train, from everyone for house well, it's called. Give a tour of it. This means that this is a compartment for domestic needs, for the main purpose. His for cases when the exercise is carried out. Officers can rest here. This type is presented here. Places for rest. Like on a train, like on a train. Presented here. Bedding included. Muffled light. Silence for every bed. Three sets of bed linen. Agree a great place to relax. Wow, how beautiful it is all done here. Smart furniture, yes. You probably know. Submariners have a concept called autonomy. When they leave, everything in autonomous navigation. You have such autonomous vehicles. Come in autonomous maximum here in your practice. More than 10 days. This is certainly not six month trips on an underwater chair, but also a serious time. And also a submariner. Just stretch your legs. Maybe at least walk back and forth. And here it's only up and down. And along with your legs, you will have to stretch your arms. By the way, what about having a snack in such an autonomous space? Food stamp is here. This is long-term storage property. So let's say emergency reserve. I understand that you also have a supply of water here. There is also a water supply. By the way, I also need to explain here. I hope you understand, fellow TV viewers, what we are in a cylinder, that is, in such a pipe. Yes, that's what the space here was square. Thanks to all these systems. And the walls may even be visible. They keep going round and round. Yes, need to add. Which is like a rocket, which is being loaded into the mine. Then they take it out of it. This vertical bunker has recently been refurbished. This is primarily due to the fact that the complex is modern. And technical systems management systems. And technological equipment for this. The facilities have also been updated respectively. It's all already installed, directly at the manufacturer's factory, into this container. And this household compartment was changed. The entire container is replaced as an assembly. But some changes have happened here. Yes, compared to previous generation complexes. There's no doubt about it. More economical conditions have been created. FO or personnel accommodation. New items include a nicer carpet on the floor. More functional covered with dishes. And the more powerful radio turns on. Simple movement by pressing one button. Turn up the sound. Ken! Listen to the radio. The longer you stay in this bunker, the more parallels with the submarine arise. In the end, both here and there are blind pipes, settled on the compartment, from which there is only one exit. Why not a submarine? How do they select people there? We know how your selection process goes. Well, in fact, selection here is carried out in advance. Psychologists work with military personnel, which, using tests, determine up. Military personnel. Officers one calculating compatibility with each other, so that there is no friction here. Yes, then the psychologist gives me his recommendation. Well, depending on. Officers agree psychologically or not. I'm already making a decision. Who will be on duty with whom? Moreover, before going on shift, every of the officers on duty passes the test personally to the regiment commander, and that's understandable. Officer Epson, this is not office plankton. He has a launcher on his desktop, the most powerful weapon on the planet. And finally, main command post location, combat post number one. The name speaks for itself. This is where it is located. Regiment battle flag. Here is the regiment commander's chair, which no one except him has the right to occupy. And here he is on constant duty around the clock. Duty force commander. It is these officers that hold up our nuclear shield. 
This is where the officers are on duty, awaiting the launch command. They elevate their role perfectly, and can't help but think about it. Because this is the same case, when pressing a button is very difficult, but if necessary, you have to do it without hesitation. And this is exactly the same command post only, not underground. And we are now at the Academy of the Strategic Missile Forces, where are the students and cadets are already mastering Sarmat. Moreover, this year the Academy will implement it. First class of officers, who will serve on these? New promising missile systems. Today, the calculation works out as standard. Scenario for such exercises, non-standard speeds in such situations. And this at the same time, mistakes are unacceptable. Pay attention, we will receive an order. Second records the time the order was received. There is time, duplicates the receipt of an order for tolerance settings. Second interview Sonia launchers will present a report. I will appear to her on the card. Document second under the one with joint action. I confirm the received order. I present a report on the state of the launchers. Second report. All half ready will delay the launch, no report received. Note, the principle of duplication works here too. And now the equipment is brought to full combat readiness. And move on to the next stage. First switching field name corresponds to stop completed. We're used to it. That flight missions happen to attack aircraft. Fighters. From transport workers. It turns out that rocket scientists have it too. And now the time comes to open the safe. Sweaty opening the safe 12 345 perform. All of them are open with a cipher grant. And again it seems everything. What we hear, this is a negotiation. Well, if not pilots, then exactly those who drive the vehicle. Rather than sitting deep underground, calculation fasten your seat belts. There is a tension circularly. Says 770 of these gambits Menshikov. Personnel to disperse equipment. Presents a report. Commander of the duty forces missile division. Air to the commander of the duty forces of the missile division. Says the commander of the duty forces of the missile division. Colonel Velchikov. Comrade Colonel. Personally, the personnel on duty at the air raid warning signal. Air raid alert. Fasten belts. It's clear why. Strategic missile forces officers must have time to complete their mission in any environment. About attention start. There is a second control over the reporting of launch operation. Controls the report. The taste has begun. I confirm the order received. First, there is a report point has begun. There is a report established since the first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th starting stops. What will happen next? It all depends on your imagination, on the number and power of warheads. And let everything we see is just teachings, but even from the hypothetical power of what is happening, takes your breath away. But for an officer of strategic missile forces, this is all normal. Attention, we will receive and duplicate the blow. Second translate commands by There is complete autonomy. This is also a teaching, but they are already passed. Not at the Missile Academy, strategic troops. And in one of the air divisions, in the SN. The drill sounds here too. The duty shift also practices. After launching missiles, but in reality, operating equipment. Air raid alert, air alert for personnel. Go into hiding. Attention, attention, hard link, hard link. Attention, attention, hard link, hard link. Why are we showing this then? So that you can watch today's episode of military training, including TV viewers from overseas, making serious decisions, so that they can see and understand with their own eyes that the officer of Essen is ready to carry out the order and that the strategic missile forces themselves continue their development and are now at their peak. Military acceptance. This is not the first time a film has been made about these self-confident, by the way, very smart guys. We told about KRVS and mobile complexes and chess installations. But then, we couldn't even imagine what level new missile systems will be adopted by the troops. And the most important thing, that all this will happen so quickly. When we recorded an interview with you a year and a half ago, you stated prophetically that the time will come, strategic missile forces. You will be surprised in a good sense of the word, and that's how it happened. We saw Vanguard. We saw Sarmat. 
What's next? First task. Support the group we are in, including and at the stage of rearmament with combat construction, which is active today, passes the missile forces. And I must point out that no matter what, 95% of the group are in constant combat readiness. Next is creation, new missile systems, and accordingly rearmament, groupings on these missile systems. And the next task, this is the development of military technical potential, which allows you to think ahead. The number of Sarmatians and vanguards will grow. It is still growing. We continue to re-equip the complex. Vanguard Sarmat, we're getting there, so that this year, already put the first regiment on white duty in Usher. Connection. And then the number will only increase. Level of modern missile armament today. Russian troops at the end of last year, 83%. The goal by the end of this year is to increase. Taking into account the deployment of a duty complex during about 86%, this is how the goals are defined. The tasks are clear. All that remains is to finish what has been started and still keep your finger on the pulse. That is, to be in good shape, continuing daily training. Pay attention to the tax order for taste. External porn fodder. This attention is attention start. Second controls the progress of launch operations, yes. We already know what the launch looks like. The mind lid will open, and our eyes will see an unforgettable picture of the start. The main thing is that all this technogenic beauty we could admire only during exercises.